we have a Muslim. Let us see what his opinion. Hello. Hello. Yes. Hi. Yes, my friend. You are a How Muslim, you? right? Um, I want to ask you a question. Yeah, but we have a topic. Uh, you believe that Jesus was on the cross and he said, Ya ilahi, ya ilahi ma sabaktani. Mm. My God, my God, mm. why hast thou forsaken me? Mm. Now, if Jesus was part of God, mm. or the Son of God, or God, as mm. Christians are confused, mm -hmm. um, why would he ask God why he has forsaken him mm. if he was part of God himself? Why would he question himself? He is not a question himself, my friend. Jesus is quoting verses from the Old Testament. And those verses, Jesus is quoting that this is a prophecy about him. Because in the Old Testament, it, say, you know, it says that the Messiah, when he come, this is what will happen to him. And this is what we will, he will say in the cross. So Jesus is just quoting something mentioned in the Old Testament. But because for you, you are quoting from a Muslim website, you think that Jesus is asking for help. He's not. He's quoting what is mentioned as a prophecy. This is why he said at the end, he said it's completed, which means all the prophecy about me being taught to you is completed. No, forsaken doesn't mean he's asking for help. Forsaken means... My friend, my friend, I just told you. Don't tell me what it's mean. We, my friend, we, we, hold on, my friend. I just told you what it's mean. Either you take what I just said to you or you don't believe in it. You see, when we debate Muslims, I don't show them my interpretation for the Quran. I show them the interpretation of your so scholars. In the Old Testament, it says if someone is hung on a cross or on a tree, then he is cursed. Yes, because he's a criminal. But, so but Jesus, Jesus he could make, no, my friend, my friend, read the verses before and read the verses after. You will see that this is speaking about criminals. But Jesus commit no crime. So anyone is hanged on the on the on the, in the wood, he is cursed for he's a criminal. If you are a person who commit a crime, well, you will go to hell. So. You are not quoting for me something about Jesus. You are quoting for me something about the criminals. Even even the, the ruler of the Roman, he said, well, you know what? I wash my hands from this, the blood of this innocent person. He commit no crime. So he have nothing to do with that verse because he is not a criminal. Unless you believe that Jesus was a, was a criminal. If no, we go... Well, was Jesus my, guilty of uh, blasphemy? Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. He is guilty of a blasphemy. You Muslims, you say that Jesus was a prophet. How he is guilty of a blasphemy if he is claiming to be a prophet? No, if if Jesus was claiming to be God. My friend, my friend. And, yes, and, if Jesus and, is a claiming and, to be God, if Jesus is claiming to be God for you, this is a crime, correct? For the Jews at that time. No problem, no problem. But this is for the Jews. My friend, I'm explaining to you. If you, My friend, my friend, my friend, my friend, hold on, hold on. If Jesus, you just said that Jesus, he claimed to be God, right? No, I said if. Okay. So, what what is the reason for Jesus to be crucified? Uh, if he was, uh, if he was claiming to be blasphemous, right? Okay. If he was claiming, what is the blasphemous? What does that mean? What does that mean? Explain to me. What does that mean? What does that mean? What does that mean? What? Why he? They wanted to kill him. Exactly. Give me the reason. He claimed to be God, if, right? Yeah. The, okay. The thank you. So, still, this is not a crime, God, my friend. Hold God, on. Hold on. This is not a crime, for he is telling the truth for the Jews. This is their justice. This is their justice. They think he is doing something they should not accept. So if you think that you are crucifying me because I commit a crime, because I claim to be, let us say, I came to you and I say I am Prophet Muhammad, and then you kill me because you think I am a false prophet. But let us say I am a true prophet, and you kill me for that. Does that mean I am a criminal? Or you think I am a criminal? If Jesus, no, he is who he is, my friend, if Jesus, if he is who he is, this is mean he is innocent of the crime he is accused with. He is saying, I am God. He is not lying. He not commit a crime. But then he would be going against the Old Testament, you know, the first commandment, you know. Which is? And you're not supposed to add partners with God, you know. We don't take partners yeah, with God. Who told you? Who told you? Who told you that we Christians? My friend, let me ask you. Do you believe in that uh, in, in that phrase, don't take partners with God? 
Do you, be, do you believe? No, no, you, 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 you as a Muslim, my friend, listen, do you believe as a Muslim, do you believe that you should not take partners with God? I believe in the Old Testament where you say... I'm asking you a certain question. You are the one who mentioned to me that in the Old Testament says don't take partners with God, correct? Yeah. Where are the Christians, they take partner with God? Well, they add partners unto God by we don't we 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 know no no this is false this this is false my friend it's you Muslims it's you who Muslims who add partner with God as an example let me show you do God have partners in knowledge in Islam what do, you mean? do God partners. have have partners in knowledge or like who is the one who have the knowledge of Allah it is partners the knowledge of heaven and earth who is the one who have knowledge that's whom He gives. The knowledge too. Who? That knowledge. Okay. Who is the one? Who is the one who have the knowledge? Uh, who, whomever he imparts his wisdom and knowledge to. So, if so, Allah he told me something, that's mean me and Allah we have knowledge. If he imparts some wisdom to you, doesn't mean you have all the knowledge. Thank you very much. It's so, just, okay. So, okay. Knowledge. That's that's wonderful. So why you Muslims you say Shahada and you associate the name of God with the name of a man his name is Muhammad and you claim that Allah and his messengers knows best What do you mean When we speak about knowledge when I let us say Muhammad is now here with us and I ask him a question And then I, I Muhammad he asked me do you know where the sun set I say no Allah and his messengers knows best is that a true statement or this is should not be said that Allah and his messengers knows best when he asked them a question and they did not know the answer mm -hmm. then they replied that Allah and his uh, prophet okay know but best Muhammad he didn't say to them don't say that Muhammad did not say don't say that, that was he was right in front of them so right. okay like when they didn't have some knowledge and he was asking him a question. I know, I know. But if somebody that. says to me now, if somebody call me and say to me, hey, Christian Prince, where the sun set? Uh, I say to him, like, yeah, now you are talking to me. I say to you, do you know where the sun set? And then he say to me, Allah and his Christian Prince knows, knows best. Didn't you associate my knowledge with the knowledge of God? No, I mean, if a scientist knows that the earth is round, and Allah knows that the no, my friend. Is no, this is about yeah, prophet. This I is not Muhammad. Is Allah not Muhammad is not a scientist. Right? Muhammad is not a scientist. He claimed that his knowledge is coming from God. Correct? Yes. Okay. So how you associate the knowledge of God with the knowledge of a man? What Muhammad he knew? Nothing. And where Allah, where where Muhammad he gave him this knowledge? He's talking about why why he didn't say to the guy, I know nothing compared to Allah. Don't compare me to Allah. This is an insult to God. I am no one. Where imagine, 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 I, you know, somebody call me and say, a hey, Christian prince, uh, uh, Christ, and you knows best. He, he associate me with, with Christ himself. Who am I? So if Muhammad is a humble man, he don't believe his God, then he should not accept the Muslims to add his name to the Shahada. And actually, he is the one who add his name to the Shahada. You associated the name of a man with the name of a God. And now you cannot be a believer unless you say the name of Muhammad and the name of Allah in one line. And the top of that, you claim, that whatever Muhammad say is from God. Is that correct? Uh, oh, you're so confused because look, my friend, the first is it true? When I asked you about the Jesus and uh, when they asked him that, do you blaspheme? Do you call yourself God or son of God? And he said, he didn't say, I say I do. He said, you say I do. See, he means that that's mean he agree with them. That's mean that's that that's I mean he didn't say. Hold on, hold on. You just admitted that he did I not. You see, you are contradicting yourself now. Jesus, when he said, you say that, which mean yes, you you agree. You just you just confirm who I am. No. He didn't say to me. He didn't say to him no. He didn't say no. He didn't. He didn't say no. He didn't say no. Did he? Did he say no? Did he say no? Did he say no? Even if my brother. Did he say Even no? Even if my brother accused me of something, I didn't do it. Mm. Let me. Let, say, let, let, okay. Let me. Let me. Let me. Okay. It. Okay. Let's if say, I say to you, if I say to you, Allah is God, and then you say to me, you said that. Does that mean you agree with me or you didn't agree? Allah said He is God. Yeah. If I say, oh, if I say Allah is God, if I say Allah is God, huh? If I say, if I, if you say to me, Christian Prince, you said Allah is God, and then I say to yeah. you, you said that. 
Is that mean I don't believe in Allah or it's mean I confirm that you just no, you mock Allah, but when Christians also believe in Allah, Arabic Christians, no, my friend, no, we don't believe in Allah. Allah this is a translation. The, the Arab, Jewish, the Arabic Christian, uh, hold on, oh, don't change the topic. You're jumping like a monkey from a place to place. Let us focus in one place. Let's, let's focus. First of all, you confirm, you confirm, hold on, hold on. You confirm, you confirm, you confirm to us since you called me. That Jesus he did the blasphemy and he claimed to be God. Thank you very much. And this is total contradiction with the Quran because the Quran. What if? What if? You didn't listen to me. If. What if? You are the one who told. I ask you why Jesus was crucified. He said because he commit he he, he did a crime which is a blasphemy. You know he said he claimed to be God. You are the one who said that. I said to him if he did. If okay, he so let, okay, okay. Tell me, tell me the reason they want to kill him. Then tell me the reason they want to kill him. Tell me the reason they want to kill him. The reason why they wanted to kill him because mm. he was saying he was a king, and basically he was saying he was a king. Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure? And uh, they had a problem with you know. Okay, this is that, based. Uh, this is based on yeah. what? This is based on the Bible or based on the Quran? You are answering me based on what religion? I looked at all three religions. I've, uh, I'm asking you. I'm asking you. What is the reason for you as a Muslim? Why the Jews they wanted to kill Jesus? Uh, did not Jesus say he was a king? And he said he was. My a friend, Muslim. I'm asking you according to Quran. Why according to Islam? Why the Jews they want to kill Jesus? According to the Quran. Yes. Why they want to kill Jesus? What the problem? No, but the Quran saying he's free of those allegations. My friend, what is the allegation? What's wrong with you? What the allegation? What is the allegation? What is the uh, my friend? Why you are so slow? What is the allegation in the Quran against Jesus? What the Jews say to Jesus to the point they want to kill? What, what is the problem between the Jews and, the, and Jesus in Islam? Why they want to kill him? The, the the allegation due to the Jews was blasphemy. Right? What where it says I that? Like where where it says that? Where it says that? Where it says where it says that? Where it says that? Well, that's what for, you you are crucified for two reasons: either being either claiming. My friend, are you are you did, did you did you eat your breakfast today? Listen carefully. Listen carefully. Shut up your mouth and listen for a second. Listen for a second. Why Jesus the Jews want to kill him according to Quran? According to the Quran, yeah, why? I, I say, yeah, blasphemy. That's what I say. So, the, uh, so are you saying that the Quran confirmed that Jesus claimed to be God? No, it, it didn't confirm. So, what blasphemy mean? Explain to me what does that mean? What, what do you mean? Blasphemy <laughs> is when someone claims to be God. Thank you. So you are saying that the Quran, you are saying, you are saying the Quran teach you that Jesus he claimed to be God, and this is why the Jews they want to kill him. No, this is what the Jews told. He this is God. not this is not the question. According to the Quran, why the Jews they want to kill Jesus? I know, and the Quran isn't saying he did blasphemy. The Quran is saying that the Jews thought he was doing where that. it says that show me if you show me i will apologize from you <laughs> can you show you me mean? that can you show me that from the quran what you just said that the jews I'm thought not, the jews I'm thought he is god no you see you, you you have no idea what are you talking about if we go to the quran chapter 4 verse 157 it says something very stupid and very funny read with me carefully that they said in boast we killed jesus christ christ jesus the son of mary who is the wars the jews the son of Mary, messenger of Allah. Look how stupid this is, is. If the Jews acknowledge Jesus as a messenger of Allah, so why they want to kill him? No, that's just saying that the Jews didn't say, oh, that was just clarifying to the people that Jesus was a messenger of Allah. That's my friend, my friend, my friend, no, 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 read with me, read with me. Don't be stupid, read with me. It says they said, hold on, hold on. It says they said, they said. Not Allah saying, they said we killed Jesus, we killed Christ Jesus, the son of Mary, the messenger of Allah. And this is between two quotations. The, the Jews, they said that. So now, the Jews acknowledge according to the Quran that Jesus is a messenger of God. Why do they want to kill him? No, the quote finishes at, um, they said they killed uh, Jesus. Who? Uh, 
Who? The Messenger of Allah isn't what they said. No, this is what they said. You want me to get your? It's in the front of you. It says a quotation. We killed Christ Jesus, the it's Son of Mary. A quotation marks in the Quran. The Quran doesn't have. My friend, my friend, my friend. Let me let, let, let me get you busted. Which Okay, let me let me get you busted. Hold on. Which interpretation you like me to read for you from? No, in the Arabic. The don't tell me in Arabic. Don't tell me in English. Arabic. Because we will not spend the day arguing Arabic. You don't know Arabic. Do you speak Arabic? I know. I, I know. I hey, know but, but, do you know Arabic? Arabic. You know, don't, so don't speak about speak don't speak about Arabic, Arabic when you do not know Arabic. Don't go there. Don't go there. It's not for, for your benefit. Now I'm asking you. you I'm asking you. Can you provide me? Can you pro hold on? Can you provide? Hold on. Can you provide me with one interpretation? I agree with you. It's not the Jews who say it. We killed the Christ Jesus, the Son of Mary, the Messenger of Allah, and this is not a quotation. Can you show me one scholar agree with you? The Jews didn't believe that Jesus is a messenger. So why the Quran saying that we killed Jesus the son of <laughs> Abdul, 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 Abdul? Listen, can you show me one scholar agree with you? What do you mean? Which well, okay, you are saying that the Jews is not, did not believe in Jesus to be son of uh, to be the, to be the messenger of Allah, right? No. Okay, so why the Quran saying we killed Christ Jesus the son of Mary the messenger of Allah? And which is color which is color agree with you that this is not the quotation of the Jews I'm saying they just said we kill them as they were boasting and they said we kill Jesus And that was like for them to say hey, no, 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 no It doesn't say they killed Jesus only don't quote don't misquote the Quran. Don't be a liar It says we killed Mary we killed we killed Christ Jesus the son of Mary the messenger of Allah here The Jews they stop talking Allah is continuing but they killed him not stop lying no, the messenger of Allah is a, a that's a clarification. It's not like they are saying that. that My friend, saying, stop lying, Allah. stop lying. Okay, show me one. Okay, 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 okay. Well, hold on, hold on. I, I will, I will show you all. Which, which website you want me to read for you from? You name it, I will show it to you, and I will show everybody that you are lying. What do you mean? You're using quotation marks, and my I friend, you, I'm not using. This is your Muslim. This is your. This is your Muslim mark. translation, not mine. This is not mine. Don't tell me you are using. I'm not my using. Clarification: When people translate, they can be wrong. No problem. No problem. No problem. What interpretation you like to read from? What interpretation you wish me to show you? Uh, do you have Pixar translation? Big Tal translation, no problem. Here we go. We go to Big Tal as you wish. Big Tal, he like Big Tal. What we can do? We have to provide him with Big Tal. Hold on. We go to Big Tal. <coughs> do you know you were saying like? Uh, don't don't word, don't change the topic. Hold on, please. Hold on, hold on. Don't change the topic. And you okay. tried to say that's the Trinity. My, don't, like change the don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. Don't change. Oh, yeah, hold on. Don't change the topic. We can go back to the Trinity when you wish. By human hold on, hold on. You you ask you ask for Big Tal. Stop talking. Stop talking. Stop talking. This is Big Tal. Read it. No, you read it. I ain't got it in front of. And because of their saying, because of their saying, we slew the Messiah, Jesus, son of Mary, all the messenger. And here, Big Tal, he put for you a dash or hyphen. They slew him not, nor crucify him. So this is the word of the Jews. They are saying, why you are saying this is not the quotation He's of the Jews? Known the messenger of Allah. There's no messenger of Allah there. It there? says there. This is Big Tal. Say, read it again. <laughs> I didn't hear you say messenger of Allah. We slew the Messiah. They are saying, let me read for you from the beginning. And because of their saying, we slew the Messiah, Jesus, son of Mary, Allah messenger. They slew him not. This is Allah talking now. And here you will see there is a there is a there's separation in space between their saying and Allah saying. You choose for me, Big Tal. Big Tal agree with me, proving you busted. And Allah here confirm that the Jews acknowledge Jesus to be a messenger of Allah. So why the Jews want to kill Jesus if they acknowledge him to be the messenger of Allah? Uh, like I said to you, it's a clarification. It's not what a clarification. It says they're saying. It says they're saying. Stop, stop playing games. It says they're saying. What is they're saying? We slew 
the Messiah, that was Jesus. The they said, yeah, we slew the Messiah, the son of Mary. And they said in both, that was their quote. No. It's a, no, stop stop lying. The mess Allah Messenger. Not, we slow no. Abdul Abdul. You see, this is the problem with when I speak to Muslims, they suffer from dishonesty. I'm not being dishonest because that's okay. True. Okay, so listen, they killed him because he is a messenger of Allah or because he claimed. No, they killed him because they told he was blaspheming. Hmm. And that's why they killed him. Thank After you very much. So the Quran is telling. So the so the so the Quran is telling a lie. So the Quran is telling a lie because simply they they accuse him of a blasphemy, and that's why he was killed. Where is the, where is he telling a lie? Because if you claim if you claim to be a prophet, it's not a blasphemy. Is that correct? No, if you if you claim to be a prophet or a messiah. That's not blasphemy. Okay, so why they killed him? You said because they they had they had blasphemy, right? Right. So when you when you do that, you oh, to be God. My okay. Thank you very much. You keep saying the same. So you confirm that the Jews they did not kill him because he claimed to be a prophet. He he was killed because he claimed to be either God or son of God. No, they thought he was claiming to be God. Oh, That's they thought. Ah, let me get you busted. Let me get you busted, my friend. This is Ibn Kathir. It says. That we killed the Messiah, the son of Maryam, the messenger of Allah, meaning we killed the person who claimed to be the messenger of Allah. Do you see it? It's not in front of me, but I'm going by this is Ibn Kathir. This is Ibn Kathir, and this is uh, totally contradict what the Quran is saying you because know, the Quran is saying, you know, like when uh, uh, the Jews were boasting and they were like. Yeah, we killed him, the Messiah or the King of the Jews because they even put a mockery. On okay, but you are the one who said to me, you are the one who said to me, but you are the one, hold on, you are the one who said to me, hold on, hold on, a second ago, you are the one who said to me, they killed him because he claimed either to be God or the Son of God. Yeah, they were probably also said that he was a messenger that uh, okay okay let me let me let me ask you let me ask you they, they did okay 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 hold on hold on hold on hold on in the quran my friend my, my friend in the quran in the quran hold on in the quran it says that the jews they killed messengers is that correct uh yeah who are they that. name for me one but in the Quran, basically, it said that they wanted to throw Abraham. My in friend, the fire. this is not the question. Name for yeah, me. No, Abraham is. What do you mean that the Jews they want to kill Abraham? There was no Jews in the time of Abraham. Are you are you are you crazy? Abraham, the Jews they tried to kill Abraham. Abraham is the grandfather of the Jews. There was no Jews yet. So Abdul, Abdul, who is the prophet okay, which? Who, who is stop playing games don't play games who is the who is the messenger of Allah the Jews they killed the bunny Israel yeah my friend this is not the question this is not the question name for me name give me a name of one hold on Abdul stop talking who are they the messengers of Allah which the Jews they killed there's a lot of look there's Messengers that are mentioned in the Quran, there's others that aren't mentioned in the Quran. Well, but and like Abdul, said, what's wrong like with the Quran question? I uh, hold on, uh, who are they? Who are they? The messengers which reported in the Quran that they slay, they killed. They okay, they they claim to have killed Jesus. What? No, it says they claim, they no, it doesn't say they claim, it says they killed. Read with me, read with me, Abdul. Stop, stop talking like crazy. Chapter 5, verse number 70. It says, it says, it says, okay, you know, so Moses ran away, they were trying Abdul, to kill Abdul, 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 listen. Who are they, the messengers? The verse in the front of me is so clear. The Jews, they killed many messengers. Not one, not two, not three. It has to be more than three because the word there is yaqtulun. So who are they, the messenger which Allah speaking of that they killed? I told you they tried to kill Abraham, but they weren't successful. Abdul, are you stupid or what? Abraham, he, there's, no, there's no Jews yet. The Jews, they tried to kill Abraham. Are you, are you a crazy man? Are you a donkey? The Quran calls them Bani Israel. There was a Jew. There was a Jew in the time of Abraham. They, they called Bani Israel. Who is the Jew who tried to kill Abraham? His son, Jacob? 
No one mentioned Jew. Where are you getting? <laughs> no, Jews it from? says Jews. It says Jews. You are. You see the problem. You, you talk too much, but you don't listen. The Quran says it clearly. وَلَقَدْ أَخَذْنَا مِثَاقَ بَنِي إِسْرَائِيلِ وَأَرْسَلْنَا إِلَيْهُمْ رُسُلًا كُلَّمَا جَاءَهُمْ رَسُولٌ بِمَا لَا تَهْوَى أَنفُسُهُمْ فَرِيقًا كَذَّبُوا وَفَرِيقًا يَقْتُلُونَ Okay, who are they? It doesn't say Jews, it says Bani Israel. Who is the Bani Israel? Aren't they the Jews, Bani Israel? Is it the Jews, Bani Israel? <laughs> My friend, okay, who are they? Was killed as a messenger by Bani Israel. Suppose he's smart now. It doesn't say Jews. It's says Bani Israel. That's what I was saying for the past. Who one. are they? Who are they? Those who they killed? Who are they? Give me their names. The the messengers, the messengers which have been slew by by Bani Israel. Tell me, who are they? They're the children of Israel, like I said. Who are they? The messenger. What's wrong with you? The Quran says that Allah sent them messengers. Some they accuse of lying, and some they killed. Who are they? The messengers, the Jews they killed. The Quran itself doesn't mention them. So why you did not give me this answer from, from from 20 minutes ago? Why you are playing all this game? Why you didn't say from the beginning? The Quran does not mention. Because he said they, they you know. But, 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 but no, you, you are looking for a lie, trying to, to cover up. Now, why the Quran mentioned? Okay, let me ask you, why, guys? Did he did he say? Did he say? Did he say? That the Quran did not mention. Okay, Allah have time to speak about the ant speaking to the ant, and Suleiman he heard the ant saying, "Hide, otherwise Suleiman will crush you." Allah have time to talk about the genie who died for Suleiman and get him jewelries. Allah have time to talk about Suleiman that a, a bird he went all the way to Yemen to find him a woman she have no hair in her legs. Allah have time to tell us the, the seven sleepers who they have a dog with them. Allah have time to tell us about the flying carpet. Allah have time all to speak about all the silly things, but yet a prophet who been killed by the Jews, Allah have no time to mention not even one name. Why? Uh, that's because uh, he, Allah imparts the wisdom. The, you know, most of the time the Quran was revealed when the, the people asked uh, the prophet a question mm -hmm. and then he gave him the answer. Okay, so people they ask him a question who are they, the messengers they were killed and he killed and he okay, okay, I will go with you. So the people they ask him a question who are they, the messengers who was killed and he told them, mm -hmm. so, What do you get this answer from? Where do you get this from? Where do you get this from? Show me the reference. You are lying. No, because a lot of the you are lying. Asking you are lying. You are lying. Otherwise, get me busted. Who are they? The one who asked him the question, and this was an answer for the question. Show me. Are you speak? Are you speaking? Are you speaking of knowledge? Are you speaking of knowledge or fabricating stories? No, the, they would ask him questions. Okay, can you show me the reference? That all what I'm saying to you. Can you show me the reference? We, I'm not a scholar, so I don't. So I'm, I'm asking scholar. you when I say to you, are you giving me your own story or giving me or giving me something? This is what happened. You said this is what happened. So it doesn't matter if you are a scholar or not. You, supposedly you you are, you are saying you are telling the truth. So now, are you telling a story of your own, or? No, I heard it from imams. So. Who is the imam? Name him for me. You all know him. He's in the UK. Ah, uh, the UK. So this Imam, he learned from who? They learn from the Hadith books. And Thank you very much. Books. Where is in the Hadith it says that that they ask him a question and this was an answer and he reported that, but he did not mention the names of the Prophet. I can't tell you exactly, but like when the Jews were asking <laughs> him about the camp. But do you know what happened here? Do you know what happened? Do you agree that the Jews they killed prophets with the verse, or you didn't agree with Allah? It didn't want it didn't say Jews, it said Bani Israel. Okay, do you agree? Hold on, guys. It doesn't say Jews, it says Bani Israel, but isn't it the Quran always named the Jews as Bani Israel? What's wrong with you? No, he calls them never the, <laughs> it just says Bani Israel. Said Abdul, Jews you are the Israel. most funny, the most funny idiot ever I saw. Oh, that you claim you it. claim that Bani Israel, according to Islam, is not the Jews. You are really, really crazy, man. Now listen. When the Quran in chapter 5, verse number 70 says that they slew the Jews, they slew the, the Prophet, do you agree with the Quran or you don't agree? Are you saying that Jews never killed any Prophet? I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. I'm asking you, 
Do you agree with the Quran when the Quran says that they slew many prophets, not one, not two, not three? They have to be many because it says they in Arabic, in Arabic, it says Fariqan Yaqtulun. It's a group of, of messengers. So do you agree with the Quran that the Jews they killed many messengers? Or you don't agree? Yeah, I agree. Okay. Why Allah He saved Jesus, but He don't want to save the other messengers? He did. You know what? Look, listen, don't before you but trap me. Look, he saved Abraham when they put him in the fire. Are you stupid or what? Abraham, and... Abraham was was killed by the Jews. Abraham, the Jews tried to kill him. Are you a donkey? They put him in the fire. Are you a donkey? Is the Jews who put him in the fire? What's wrong with you? No, the Bani Israel, they put him in the fire. When there was no Israel at that time, you donkey. There was no Israel. The children of Israel, it's mean the children of Jacob, you donkey. Jacob was not born yet. How the children of Israel became a nation before Jacob is born. Jacob is just born. Now he became a baby and now he's the son of Abraham. And now there's the children of Israel. They are going to kill Abraham. No, this refers to who is the one who is the one was trying to kill Abraham, the Jews, the, the children of the Israel, followers of the prophets of the followers of the prophets. They were good. Get out. And the funny, some Christian they say to me, You need to, you need to have to have to be more patient. Don't call me, don't call me. You have to be, you have to have some patient. Go in the comment, you will see many Christians say, Christian prince, you have to have some patient. If you talk to those people, you will go crazy. A bunch of idiots. The children of Israel is the one who was burning Abraham. <laughs> if Israel is the son of Abraham, and from 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 his seeds we have later tribes, we have many sons, and they are people who became a tribes and became nation. How are you stupid you say that the Jews or the, the children of Israel they are they are the one who tried to burn Abraham? This is the most stupid statement ever I heard. But because they cannot say to us, why Allah, if the Quran confirmed that the Jews they killed the prophets.